Gals and guys, go to Tracy Brown Live. Go to Tracy Brown Live. Go to Tracy Brown Live. Gals and guys, go to Tracy Brown Live. Go to Tracy Brown Live. Go to Tracy Brown Live. Gals and guys, go to Tracy Brown Live. Go to Tracy Brown Live. Go to Tracy Brown Live. I want to sneeze. Hi, Island Dreamer. How are you? Gals and guys, go to. How are you doing? Did I go live on here? Oh, wait. Oh. I didn't go live. Okay, I'll do it one more time. Brown live. Go to Tracy Brown live. Go to Tracy Brown live. Gals and guys, go to Tracy Brown live. Go to Tracy Brown live. Go to Tracy Brown live. I got a hole in my shirt. Eh, whatever. This just tells me I have to throw this out. Did your mama ever tell you that? That if you get a hole in your private community clothing, she throw it out. Did your mama ever tell you that? I'm going to do that. Great. It's my last day of all. How are you? How do you feel? How do you feel? Right? Your mama told you that too, right? If you get a hole in something, throw it out. Throw it out. So, I guess I have to throw this out. But there are some days I don't go anywhere, so why should I? But I should be presentable to you all. <sighs> Plus, I don't sew, because this would be very easy to sew, right? I could put a pin there and make it... Oh, I could put a pin... All right, I'm so cheap. I don't want to throw it out. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm masking up and going in. I'm about to be out here slippery. They could have least waited till the snow ended, Island Dreamer. Come on. All right, let's get today's reading out the way. And let's look at it. Please, God, let it be good. I'm still using the Tazama, Tazama Tarot. I kind of like, I like the book a lot. The star card, the star, ouch, that hurts. The star card, look at it carefully, because these are just positioned very differently. Much like like um, in our group, one of the girls had a African based tarot, but I do believe the artist was African, and her cards are really good. Like I was drawn to them. Um, hey Marie, good morning and good health. Yes. Um. So look at the card good. For some reason, there you go. Hey, CJ. Hey, CJ. Look at the card good. This is the star card. The star card. It's really funny because this bucket um, that this kid is carrying, the water seems to be like gushing out of it like magic because it's not tilted for all that water to come out. Uh oh, oh! I gotta go. How did they get in? All right, I gotta go. Do you want to? Do you want to stay on? All right. The star card. Let me read it real quick because they said they will call me, and it sounds like they're like canoodling with each other. Men love each other, by the way. Men love men. In a good, and I'm not saying in a bad way. I'm just saying they like to, hey, do hey, like all that stuff. But when we do it, we look, hey, when we do it, it's weird. Men do it too. All right, the star card. I 
got a delivery coming because this is an Airbnb turned apartment. So other than spoons and forks, nothing's in this apartment. So I made him take out the two twin beds and I had to buy my own bed when I first got here. But there's no bookshelves. There's nothing for me to be like, make it home, right? And because of the candle business, I'm starting to have boxes all over the place. And I don't know about you, but it's starting to make me feel worrisome, right? It's starting to make me feel like, like the, the house is closing in on me. So yesterday I brought a book shelf and I also figured out that this chair, which doesn't belong to me, belongs to the landlord, has contributed to my knee issues. So yesterday I went to um, Office Max, is what we have out here, and I sat in a chair for like an hour and a half. By the way, I could, I could do that. The security guard kept coming up to me and he was like, are you okay? And I was like, I am. And he kept checking on me. <laughs> But I was sitting in a chair to see if I could sit in a chair. And yesterday was my day off because I go to the post office to deliver the candles. And so I had time on my hands. I had already eaten breakfast, so I didn't need lunch. And so I was just sitting there. And so it turns out the chair that I was sitting in, which I didn't know it was on clearance, So I looked at the price of the chair and I said, okay, this is a good price. Thinking all the chairs must be like that. I start to look at the other chairs. Uh-uh. Expensive, right? So I went back. I heard Spirit say, you ain't got, this is not an option. So I went back to the chair and it was on clearance. And you know when God has something for you, right? I don't know if you understand spiritually what that means. But when something is waiting for you, it's waiting for you. Because this chair was cheap, right? So I go back to the chair and now I'm panicking, right? Because I don't see it in the boxes anywhere. So I call the guy over and I said, I would like this chair. He says to me, we got chairs uh, cheaper. And I was like, okay, show me. He goes to show me, couldn't find one thing cheaper. So I go back to it and he didn't know it. So I was like, I think I'll just take this one. He goes, okay, take the slip. And I said, am I getting a new chair? And he absolutely, it was the floor model chair. I guess that's why it was so cheap. But then they gave me a two year free warranty like, it's kind of like they felt bad for me because I was getting a floor model chair and I thought I was getting jackpot. And then they gave me a two-year warranty. Free. And I was like, thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. But I was like, ciao. I would carry this chair on my back right now. I don't need a warranty, but I didn't say that. Hold on. That's that. Thank you. Oh, yeah. 
Okay, I'm sorry, guys. <clears throat> Hold on a second. Whenever somebody comes into my house, I do a little light off, but he has to come back in anyway. I just want to take my mask off. Nice little stinks. Hi, Sylvie. Hi, Sky. I see, see, I see, see. Hi, Cocoa Butter. Oh, what a cute name. Um, I put Cocoa Butter on my face every night. Tracy, can you make a white candle that smells like coconut? CJ, the power candle. I don't have it here. The power candle does have coconut in it. It's coconut and grape in it. So I, I, I'm a way ahead of you. But it's not white. It's power. Because I found out later, I discovered, I think that you do things by accident. Cocoa butter is cleansing and grape is for abundance. But I just ordered coconut soy blend. So I'm a, and if, if it works out well, all the candles will be coconut soy blend if it works out well. So I'm constantly tweaking this, this thing that we call a, um, a business. <laughs> And I'm hoping that it, I'm hoping it melts better. So then a the guy, he comes in and my candles are on my table. You guys don't get to see that part. I've got my candles all over this huge table that the landlord left behind. Like Amazon, like it's this high, the table, the chairs are this high. It's a nightmare, right? Because I'm a little kid, right? Body-wise, right? So I got my candles and then the guy walks in and he goes, oh, candles, candles. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I can do this for a living. Oh. <laughs> I'm like, oh, wait. You get a tip it. Damn it. That's the only thing when you get something delivered. You have to tip people. Do you realize that? Why is it taking them so long to get back here? Oh, come in.
Okay, guys. Now, y'all remember in my other place, what kind of chair did I have? I had this kind of chair. Come on, guys. You guys remember. This is the kind of chair that I had. Hold on. It's an orgasm. This is nice. nice that's a chair do you like it it's the exact chair <laughs> it's the exact chair <laughs> I know <laughs> okay hold on a second the last chair I got from Amazon though <laughs> you're making me hot the last year I got from Amazon, but look, I don't stray. I don't stray. And the seat is nice and cushy. Like, I feel like I'm going up in space. Look, look, look. okay, hold on a second. Uh, okay, hold on. Ah. <gasps> oh. Okay. Okay. Orgasm over. Whew. Hold on a second. Whew. And it turns out the guy noticed the, the candles. And then I said, I said, I make them, but I want to show him the candle. Not this one. These are samples. I've got them in boxes already. So I went to show him the candles. And then he goes, I love candles. What guy you know loves candles? Especially Caribbean guy, right? He goes, no, no, no. You don't understand. I got candles here, 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 here. He was going to show me, but he left his phone in the car. Always carry your phone, people, because you never know. You never know. So it turns out, he said, can I have your number? I don't, I don't remember why. I think for the candles or something like that. And then, thank you. <laughs> and then he goes, um, so I was, no, he said, do you have a business card? And of course, I don't have business cards, right? Because I'm not prepared right but i had old business cards right and so i gave him my old business card which i found like yesterday and so it was two people one really young like less than my son's age and um i don't know how old he is but i gave gave him my card what caribbean guy you know says he loves candles come on people they're out there so be aware that spiritual men are showing up in your lives, right? Stop looking for the sexy hood dude. Stop it. Stop it. They don't do nothing for you, but they do give good sex. That's the only thing. The hood dude, the hood dude will throw it down, but they're not good for you. Mm -mm, they're not good for you. Alan Dreamer. Look at the star card. Already working. <laughs> star card. All right. Let's get to reading. The star card brings hope and optimism to your life. Feel free to wish upon a star and aspire to your goals. Success is in your hands. Make a wish upon the star. That bright, shiny star. And feel good about the future. Let your inhibitions go and show your true self to the world. Now is your time you take center stage and let your influence flow everywhere god i'm thinking of so many people this is for so many things are balanced they are going to notice you 
you're a star. Affirmation, I step into prominence and go confidently in the directions of my dreams. Wow. Thank you, A.B. Thank you. Oh, wow. Wow. That's what I'm saying. The men are there. The men are there. They're not hiding themselves. They're not trying to be like all men. They're willing to be open and softer and kinder and metaphysical. They're there. So I'm not saying look to them for romance. I'm saying find them because they're our people. All right. The affirmation, I want to write it down. Sure. I step into prominence and go confidently in the directions of my dreams. That's beautiful, guys. That's beautiful. Let me see if I can hold this up so you guys can see it, too. Thank you, Magic Mermaid. I love the orange. Very, very beautiful. I'm telling you guys, this book, I don't know if I could use it as a tarot card for me personally. Um, I, I think the, the visuals don't relate very well to me. I would have to work too hard to redirect my mind but it is wonderful for dashikis and bonnets. I mean, wonderful. But for somebody else, it could be perfect as a tarot card. And I accidentally just picked one up. The sun. So because I accidentally picked up the sun, to just look at the visuals of another card, we're going to read the sun. Something good is coming through. Remember the Pisces moon. Remember the Pisces moon. And the star is not far from the sun. In a book. But technically it's not far from the sun up there either. The sun. Here comes the sun. Here comes happiness. Here comes success. Here comes innocence. Here comes joy. This is a very uplifting card. You are bathed in good vibes and out on the town. Enjoy that sunshine, baby. Clouds have lifted. May foretell the birth of a child even. You will soon be wearing your crown. You know what I found out? Every culture has a crown. Every culture has a crown. Did you guys notice there's a Ukrainian crown that looks very similar to the African crown? Every culture has a crown. You will soon be wearing your crown. You will be recognized for your efforts. Bask in the sunlight. You've earned it. Embrace your inner child. Are you guys embracing your inner giggleness? The, the giggle person inside? I love embracing my, my inner child. I'm not going to grow up. It's not going to happen. Ever. Affirmation, my inner child is filled with energy and enthusiasm. I'm going to hold it up for YouTube again. You guys can go over to YouTube and check it out. 
How hot is that? Who's on? Do you like that so far? You guys got the star and the sun in one day. You tell me something's not coming down the pike spiritually. Who understands that? Who is this for? Because it could be for everyone. All you got to do is make a decision that this belongs to you, and it will be. There's enough air to share. Hmm? You like that? There's enough air to share. Oh, child. I always embrace my inner child. I had a spiritual awakening. That's so cool, sweet Jensen. Ah, yes, come through, spirit. Ashe, oh, Dory. Oh, oh Ashe, oh, Dory. Yes. Oh, look at I am, she believes. The sun is also a star. I forgot. Yes. Yes. The sun is also a star. <gasps> What's going to happen, guys? Who am I talking to? Because I hope that everyone on this feed and everyone that watches later and everyone that's drawn to me accepts that this is you. Oh, that was kind of emotional right there. Oh my God. All right, you guys like my chair? <laughs> Who said it? Same chair, Tracy, same chair. same damn chair <laughs> when you have a type you have a type <laughs> oh hello sweeties okay i gotta go because i have to go to work and i say that lovingly but i just really have to go i love you guys thank you thank you for putting up with the inner child in me and the crazy in me and <sighs> Letting people deliver a chair in the middle of a feed. <laughs> Have you ever watched I, uh, Ayana's uh, podcast? She's just as silly on her podcast. I love to watch her. <laughs> she argues with her sons. It ain't working. It is not working. <laughs> Has she put out any videos lately? Yes, this is the this is us shining bright like the sun star. You guys are being poetic right now. <laughs> She's so funny, right? Ayana is so funny. She's so funny. God, the things that you can learn from others. All right, I gotta go. Hi, more of a woman. Oh, I like that name. Why do I remember seeing you before? All right. I was going to come back on later, but I forgot why. But if I remember, I'll come back on. But I got to do the horoscopes. Horoscopes are up. Then I got to do the other half. All right. Love you. Bye.